What's up guys, Rukario Sign here, and today I'm going to be going over a very, very interesting deck, uh, one that my teammate Connor B. Slowboy Click has brought to my attention after seeing one of our friends actually lose to this at Toronto Regionals. Um, so I don't know why someone would play this. <laughs> um, so the, the, the star of the show is Spirit Tomb. Uh, has that ability curse whirlpool so as long as this pokemon is your active your opponent's active can't retreat uh it sounds kind of bad at first glance because they can just goosebum around it but uh we only run one so that's impossible um i actually did run two right before uh recording this um i, I i've never actually played a game with only one um yeah the the i guess i, I guess the only thing i used a second for was just like you know like just in case you know the first one dies but if the first one dies you just kind of lose anyways because then they have their main attacker out and unless you can guzman repeat the process uh it's just it just kind of uh just kind of gimmicky so we're gonna have one spirit tomb the idea of the deck is to guzma something really stupid so it can attack and you win that's um that's it that's the whole deck uh, so we do this with four Guzma, four Catcher. Uh, so that's initially what we try to do is uh, is Guzma them out. And if they if they don't want to bench it, oh no, we just run four four Poke Puffs and we can make them put it down anyways. Uh, so yeah, but what happens if they can attack? What happens if they're running Zora Lucario and they have a Mewtwo or something and that thing can attack, right? Well, for that we run. For Crushing Hammer, for Flare Grunt, for Plumeria, um, all sorts of fun cards. Um, and then we also run four Enhance Hammer, four Enaporter for that extra energy disruption. Um, Enaporter, uh, actually, actually, really, really solid in this kind of deck. Uh, you don't even Enhance Hammer and discard it so they can get it back. You just move it. Uh, to a bench Pokemon. It doesn't have to be even like a useless Pokemon because you brought the useless one in the active. So, um, so like if they attach a DC to the Mewtwo, you can just end up order it to the bench Zorak and they can't even, they can't even use it. Um, so it's actually better than the Hands Hammer in that regard. So we were on four of those special energy, um, denial cards. Uh, what else do we run? We do, uh, we also run full four Skull Grunt because we have like no draw support. Um, so your opponent reveals their hand, discard two energy cards from it. Uh, very, very, uh, good late game, like against Zork or something. Um, you know, cause uh, when you're playing this deck, your opponent's going to have like 5 million cards in their hand. So like, they're almost certainly going to have energy unless all of them are in the discard pile already. So, uh, <laughs> along with the energy denial, um, yeah, because Mewtwo or Flying Flip is going to hit you for 20 every turn. We run 4 Max Potion uh, to heal. Uh, this thing only actually has 60 HP. So we <laughs> we really have to bring up something useless. Um, even Lele is kind of kind of bad because we bring up Lele and they DCE and they hit for 40. Then we have to use Potion like immediately. Um, we can't even wait. So with Mewtwo at least, or uh, Tapu Koko, we can like wait a turn. Um, so yeah, there is... Uh, there's a four max potion, four super potion. Uh, <laughs> it, it, it's max potion. Uh, heals 60 from one of your Pokemon if you do discard energy. We don't run energy. So, yeah. Um, that's uh, that's that's the gist of it. <laughs> that's the entire deck. Um, we also run four order pad to get, like, Poke Puffs when we need, when we need it. Enhance Hammer, Enhance Hammer and Enaporter being the primary target for order pad. Um, we also run two handiwork. Um, is that right? Yeah, we run two handiwork. Um, just, uh, just like when we, cause a lot of the times we're just passing and I figure why not actively being like, why not actively discard their deck while we're passing? So that's why I run two. Um, uh, maybe we can get an energy in the discard pile or two. Um, and I run two Gladion cause Gladion's really, really good. We can grab, uh, literally like anything you need is going to be in the, um, in the prizes, uh, if you need a catcher, if you need a Guzma, a Flare Grunt, the, like there's going to be a card that you need in the prizes. Um, it's too glad I'm very, very good. Too loose to me to grab back Flare Grunts. That's really, that's really it. Um, maybe Cynthia, because I do run one Cynthia um, as sort of a last resort um, if your opponent is... You know, I've played against some opponents that just they have a full hand and they Cynthia to prevent themselves from deck decking out. 
where before it used to be N because nobody played Shauna, right? So they played N and you'd be like, all right, I just get a new hand too. I mean, like I still win. Um, if your opponent plays Cynthia, you do not still win. You lose. Um, so you, you really have to play a Cynthia in case they're smart and decide to outplay you. Um, then I run four puzzle of time uh, just because to get those disruption cards back. Um, I think I covered every single card. Uh yeah, that sounds about right. Um, so yeah, one Pokemon, fifty nine trainer cards. What can go wrong? Um, so onto the matchups. Um, Buzz will, yeah, pretty auto win. Uh, since Remoray can't really attack, uh, unless they're running the Wild River one, that gets kind of tricky. Um, so if they run the Wild River one, you just want to like bring up like Deancey Prism is a really good target in Buzzwool. Um, make them attach the energy, and they're probably going to evolve into, Octil into Octillery, which is good because you can goose them to that, and then they can't do anything, and you win. Um, and then Rainbow Road also, uh, I'd consider an auto win. You can just bring up a Valk, you win. Um, Ultra Necrozma, uh, this one's kind of tricky because they have to have Dawn Wings down. Um, so you have to get Dawn Wings in the active, uh, and then Flare Grunt to hammer them. Uh, yeah, and then if you run them out of energies, I mean, that thing costs three energies, so if you whiff a turn, uh, a flare grunt or a hammer or whatever, um, then you can just, um, you can just wait a turn and then top deck something, and then, yeah, that, that's how that works. Uh, unless they run two Dawn Wings, um, then that would be bad because they can just Dawn Wings, um, LMR, and then, yeah, Invasion, the other one. Uh, Zorark ish, I only say ish because, like, if they don't run Mewtwo or Coco, um, and they just have, like, Zorark. Or Lucario, Lycanroc, whatever. Um, Lycanroc I can deal with because that's two energy. Um, but even so, two energy is kind of kind of stressful. Um, Lele is an option to Guzma, uh, but it's kind of scary because they can hit you for 40 right off the bat. And if you're dealing with something like a Lucario, then they can Kukui. And <laughs> yeah, the plays that you have to think about when you're playing this sort of deck. Um, yeah, they have a 20 card hand. They can Kukui and energy drive you for the game. Um, and yeah, auto losses, anything that can get, like, anything that can one-shot you from nothing. Um, so, Bulu. Bulu is a prime example. Um, since they pull the energy from deck, you just lose. Uh, if I see Grub and I just scoop. <laughs> um, Greninja also, it doesn't matter how much you try to stall him. Uh, I can't really think of a card except, like, if they run Volcanion Prism, which I don't know why they would. Why they would. Um, or, like, Tapu Fini. Um, or Lele, even. Uh, but like if they don't bench those and you can't find them, you just lose. Uh, Garboder. Oh, and also, yeah, Stormy. Stormy. Uh, <laughs> then you get back the energies. Uh, Garboder is kind of an auto loss because it kind of negates the ability and they can just retreat, uh, whenever they want. Uh, I did run Lysander Labs for a decent amount of time, but like I use it once today and they just feel bored and you've won. So it's better better off trying to like guzma chain like stupid stuff like grandpas or whatever um yeah but garboder's tough and then the card switch uh you just lose if they play the card switch like i don't know why i've run into legit two alternate cross decks that just play switch and uh yeah i just uh i just i just lose <laughs> i was like who plays switch um but yeah we're gonna we're gonna jump right into these matchups um Hopefully we can get some Buzzwool. Hopefully, um, so yeah, Buzzwool. The uh, reason why it was Buzzwool-ish, um, like if they Brooklet Dancy and or start with Prism, you just kind of lose, uh, or or not Prism, Beast Energy. That that's it. Um, we want a coin flip. We really don't care. Uh, what they, what was that? Psychic, Metal, and Fighting. Interesting. Let's see how many times we Mulligan. Because like I said, this is the first game I've played with only one Spiritomb. Um, <laughs> true story. <laughs> I've, uh, if you're wondering what the uh, last card is, uh, if if you're wondering, um, I only ran three Secret Potion before, but uh, yeah, you don't you don't need you don't uh, need second Spiritomb at all. All right, so we're gonna Mulligan. Um, we're gonna get there. You go two Mulligans. Wow, that's uh. That is impressive. That is very impressive. I will say that. Uh, so our hand is not looking too hot. Um, I don't know. Like, it depends what they're playing. If they start with something stupid, we just win. 
that's really how this deck works. Or if they start with uh, they start with Dawn Wings, we're okay, fine. Uh, like I said, to start with Dawn Wings, we're fine. We're gonna lead with that Skull Grunt. Oh, Beast Box. All right, got it, got it, got it. Um, oh wait, we just win, right? <laughs> yeah, I think we just win. Um, yeah, yeah. No, no, yeah, we definitely win because they they don't play Psychics. They might. I don't know. I was thinking about playing Beast Box with Psychics. Um, Ultra Space. Yeah, grab uh, grab something. <laughs> like, um, but yeah, we're in, uh, we're in good shape here because they can't attack with uh, Dawn Wings. And um, yeah, we can we can just sit behind the Spear Tomb and win, pretty much. So yeah, that is... Uh, we're just going to grab Buzzle. See... I, I almost feel bad for bringing this deck online, but like you're gonna you're gonna find the most success with this. I mean, look at look at it. they're playing elixirs, you know, they're they're, they're ultra spacing. <sighs> yeah, and then this is the old uh, attach a float stone and try to retreat, uh, but then you realize you can't retreat, and then you uh, and then you cry. <laughs> this is so bad. See. I almost, I almost don't like decks like this because it's sort of like, <clears throat> it's sort of like, um, I see it as like kind of gimmicky, you know, like I've never played mill. I've never played keep more. I I've never played Houndoom, never played anything. Uh, but just, just like having a 60 HP, it's a, like a, it's uncommon. It is an uncommon card from shining legends. And it's, I mean, it's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. I was thinking about playing this in Expanded, because uh, I was like, oh, well, that could play four Lysanders. Um, Hex Maniac. So, that's that's why I didn't do that. Um, yeah, he's probably going to Sycamore or something. Yeah. I mean, I just I just don't know what to say. I, like, 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 we just... <sighs> can we, can we, uh... Q curb your enthusiasm. Boom, boom, boom. Da 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 da. Yeah, he's just gonna sick him more. Um, I don't know what to say. All right, we got a beast. Cool. Um, maybe they'll uh try to go for uh. Maybe should we end up order two? Or you just go puzzle. Yeah, it will be nice. Well, we'll power up your puzzle for you. There, you. there you go. You're welcome. You're welcome. You are welcome. Maybe they play. Maybe they play two psychic energy. I was actually thinking that so I could like B string. Um, yeah. The best part about uh going up against like Ultra Beast nonsense whatever is that they just can't use B string. So um like I've heard about people playing like heavy B string counts like on Hey Ponte. Um. And stuff, and like if you just play a heavy B string count, uh, you just can't use any of them. So, uh, all right. yeah, so he's just gonna attach fighting energies. That's uh, great, <laughs> good for you. Oh, there's another dawn wings. I like, I just don't understand what they can do. I, sure, give me that, this is fun, this is fun, this is fun, I like seeing my, <laughs> no, this is horrible, um, it's preferred when they just scoop, I don't understand, am I missing something, what if they play Ninja Boy or something jank? Oh, oh no, oh, I'm sorry. That's not the right energy. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, bud. If he plays Ninja Boy, that's just gonna like, you know, because I actively haven't been using like my plume areas. That would be so funny if he just Ninja Boyed into like a puzzle <laughs> and then like knuckle impacted. Um, yo, I'm slightly nervous about <laughs> I'm slightly nervous about that. Is that bad? Is that bad? 
Um, yeah, we just no Ninja Boy, no Ninja Boy for you. Sorry, you don't get the Ninja Boy into uh, into Buzzwool. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> nothing personal, kid. Nothing personal. <sighs> yeah, so so yeah, this is this is how you win. This is the uh, yeah. Look at it, just one spear team. That's it. That's that's all you need. That's all you need to win. Uh, I was actually thinking about like teching one of these into. Okay, yep. Yeah, there's the uh the old uh scoop of runies. Um. See, that's the thing I hate about this deck. You climb the ladder so slow because. I, okay, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think you get less like points when you scoop, um, or when they scoop rather. So. Yeah, we're just, uh, we're inching by 10 each time. Uh, so it looks like this guy is going to be playing water box. I've actually seen a lot of water box. I don't know why. I don't think it's very good. I, I think it's like, I, I've always thought water box was good. Uh, I guess now that Gullis spot isn't like BDIF, it might have a chance again. Um,. What's uh? What's going on? All right, you got no basic. Ah, uh, wait, I'm wait, wait, wait. Okay, so what's the color list? We might. I'm actually gonna play this one out. Uh, even though I said Greninja was an auto loss, I'm going to play this one out because um. Oh, probably Town Flame. That's okay. Yeah, we just kind of we just kind of. <laughs> Town Flame is bad too. Two Mulligans. Wow, we've been like really conservative on the Mulligans. Um. I don't know. I mean, we just have to hope for them to bench uh, Feeny or something. Yeah, Town Flame. Uh, God, why can't Aerobos do like 20 or something? I guess we can run out of... We can run them out of energy. And then when they star me, then we bring up the star me. That's what we do. <laughs> so stupid. Um... So we can uh, go for that crushing hammer and handiwork. They're gonna try to go for that froki, and they do not get it. So we're gonna hammer. Okay. So yeah, we have to flare grunt. I'm afraid we have to flare grunt, and that is our turn. <laughs> that is our turn. Uh, hand hammer for splash energy. Sure. Uh, I wouldn't mind too much plumeria, plumeria, plumeria ing those away. Um, wouldn't mind much at all. So, uh, yeah. Sycamore. What? Oh. Okay. That's, um, that's horrible. <laughs> um, cool. Okay, so they attach a splash to the bench. I'm actually glad they're not gonna apply pressure. Um... Okay, to Gladion or Rocket. I'm gonna Gladion. Yeah. Oh, two Flare Grunt. Yeah, good thing we did. Oh, wow. Okay, we beat the Auto Loss. That's impressive. Uh, <laughs> who knew that one Spirit Tomb could cause so much destruction? It's just, it's just beautiful. The thing I like about these games is <laughs> they're so short. I mean, like, I'm probably like, I'm most definitely gonna play more than three. Um, fails never fails, except when it does. So, what was that? Fighting, metal, and psychic. Didn't we have that like last time? Wasn't wasn't that beatbox? Well, that doesn't make sense. What's the metal? Dust main? Nah. Oh, it is beatbox. Okay. So uh, yeah, I sh I should I should add that to my uh, my auto wins. Um, this box is uh is an auto win. Fifty. <laughs> <laughs> ah, there we go. There's a there's a good one. There's a good one. Is there a rule about that? I'm I need to look that up. Is there um maximum mulligans uh 
Pokemon TCG. Yeah, I think we like for for <laughs> for tournament play. I, I t your opponent gets too many mulligans. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So it looks like it's legal. Okay, this is this is off of Reddit. So, um. Take it as a grain of salt. Wow, after 50 Mulligans, they just... What was that? They just Lado and then Cynthia. That must have been a bad hand. Um, yeah, so so anyways, it, it looks like that uh, you can Mulligan as much as you want. Um, okay, so... This is tricky. Okay, so they're gonna end us. Um, this is bad. This is very bad. Um, should I handiwork or try to Cynthia? Um, no, I'll Cynthia to try to get some energy denial. Um, okay. Come on. Don't make it. Yeah, we probably lose. We probably lose. If they can end to a half decent hand. Like, if they get a Naganadel and, um, what do they need? They need, uh, oh, they literally just need one more bench piece. Yeah, so they just need a Naganadel and then, like, another one. Yes! All right, cool. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, shoot. Well, they didn't, they didn't even bench a Dawn Wings or anything. That's, that's, uh, that's deep. Um. We're gonna, nuts. We're gonna double puzzle. We're gonna, I, cause I want a Pokepuff. Um, we don't need Cynthia. Well, we might. I probably just, I'm gonna regret that. We're gonna Pokepuff. Okay. We can temporarily bring up the lele that works yes all right awesome um so i mean that buys us an extra turn um did they have any energies in no, i don't think so why don't they pay attention to these things yeah um i don't think they did yeah they just had supporters um yeah no we're fine we have Flare Grunt, Double Hammer. Yep. So we're good. I did not misplay. Um, so we just need we just need to uh, bench that Dawn Wings and that's game. And we run four Pokebuffs, so the odds of getting another one are fairly high. So uh, let's let's see what happens. I'm actually kind of interested. Um, yeah, because this deck doesn't play. Okay, so they're gonna fighting. Uh Ultra Ball. Dawn Wings! No, they're not going to gonna grab Dawn Wings. Uh, yep, they're going to grab Naganadel. Um, I don't know why. I, don't, I think they're going to attack with it or something. Okay, awesome. We top deck another Flare Grunt. I love when this deck just does things. Like, I, I love when it just top decks, like, Flare Grunts and stuff. Like, okay, perfect. Um... This is a perfect time for uh, handiwork. Yeah, we just theoretically, um, I'm just thinking like real long term here. Um, we uh, we okay. So there's another energy. Just gonna flare ground. Okay, there's a the handiwork. Awesome. Oh, we should have hammered and tried to go after the handiwork. Actually, I might want to save that handiwork. Okay, we run two. Okay. Um. Okay, it doesn't look like they're going to try to... Oh, Cartana. Interesting. Is that just for Slice All? Or does he run Metals? He must run Metals. Yep, we're not letting him attack. No way. No way. Uh, okay, handiwork or skull grunt? Hmm. 
We can either risk it. One, two, three, four, five. Is it worth it? Um, yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it. Booyah. We got one. Perfect. Cool. Yeah, see, that's why I run four. Four skull run is good. All right, so there's six energies. Ah, oh, what? No fair. Okay, well, we got, we got two max potion. Worst case scenario. And, all right, I'm fine with that. Totally fine with that. Please grab a ton wings. Please grab a ton wings. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, we're just Plumeria. I usually don't like discarding cards, but we want to guarantee the game. So, what is that? One, two, five, six, seven. God, where are all these energies coming from? Eight. Stop it. You can't float zone. Stop. You can't retreat. Stop it. Get some help. <laughs> um. Skullgrunt? Or Guzma? Skullgrunt. No. They just out? Okay. So, I, like, honestly, I, I don't regret that. Um. Because, I mean, like, okay, wait, let's see. Why? Um, Six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, there's no way they, no way they run one nine. I could even bring up like a buzzwool or something, or this poipool. Well, if they run a tenth, um, oh, they probably run beast energy. That's what they run. Um, score runs any energy, right? Yeah, it's not just basic. Uh, yeah, like we're just. There's no reason for us to do anything else. If, uh, yeah, because I'm guessing it's nine fighting, one beast. Yeah. Yeah, I think we, uh, I think we, I think we got this. What are we going to order fed for? I don't. Should we go for it? Nah, I'd rather order pad for a second puzzle if we, if we top deck something. Yep. Okay, perfect. Um We have not played any handiwork. Oh man. That sucks. Yeah, we're just um I'm not even gonna I'm gonna wait till he gets down like two cards and then try to order pad for puzzles. Okay, well we got another order pad. Maybe maybe we can do something now. Uh yeah, because we need that um We're going to space and see what's in our deck. Okay, cool. We got the Gladion. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, yeah, we did. Okay. Yeah, I really just want to top tackle like a handiwork at the right moment. No, we just keep getting order pads. <laughs> like we needed that. Oh, he probably plays super odd. Oh, wait, it's in the discard. Great. Perfect. Amazing. Um, come on, please, handiwork, please, 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 no, handiwork, I wish, yeah, I wish Trick Shovel was standard, please, I, like, I wish Trick Shovel was totally standard, yeah, like, if, if, okay, usually what happens is they usually go down to one, and then on their last turn, in their last card, they use Cynthia, just to maximize uh, the number of turns, but he's probably thinking about handiwork as we speak uh because he's not doing anything and he probably, he's probably like oh well okay nope he's just gonna wait he's gonna wait it out uh flirt might as well might as come on might as well <laughs> um cool so we have two more turns wait uh, if he ends when he's at skyla what the does that play skyla Oh, okay, perfect. We just win. I don't know if he was trying to, like, Skyla for N, and then, like, oh, man, the last end surprise. Um, I don't know what happened there. But we we uh, came out with the W, and we're going to go on to game number four. What the? What is he playing? Probably, probably Volk. 
Is that fire, fire and water? Oh, thank you. You have no idea, though. You have no idea. Okay, great. Perfect. <laughs> Win number four. Yeah. Oh, we, look it. We got... Okay, that's interesting. We actually got more than 10. To, so I don't I don't know how these points work. Um, I never I never ladder grind at all. Um, but like the last few days I've been um I've just been like trying to uh to climb the ladder. Not with Spirit Tomb. Spirit Tomb was like th this was this contraption was made like last night. So I only played this thing for not that uh not that not that long. All right, let's see if we can break like 30 mulligans. You know, it would be great if we could get one game where we mulligan like 50 times and then we just flip heads on handiwork and win. Can we do that? That'd make my day, please. All right, let's see. Uh, let's uh, let's check the mulligan count. 13, not bad. Not bad at all. The best part, okay, honestly, the most underrated part about um, mulligans is it makes them want to bench more. Like, it actually makes, like, you know, just, like, getting more cards. Look at all those cards. He's going to bench something. Come on. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, school grunt. That'd be really spicy. Got to have those energy in there. Ooh. Um, not even going to go for the beast. Just going to go for the fightings. Yeah, because, uh, this Dancy is, uh, this, well, I'll just leave this Dancy here. All right, perfect. I've never actually hit a double energy on school grunt before. That's perfect. Um, okay, so if he benches a Remoraid, we win. If he... Come on, please, Brooklyn, for that Remoraid. I know you can do it. Come on. Do it. Do it. Wouldn't that be right? No. He's not going to do it. And he attaches to the bench. Can we tap that in another school run? I know he still has like five energies in there. All right, yeah. So our plan is just going to be to uh, to pass and then to pass, then to pass, and then to pass. It's our plan. It's our uh, game plan. It's what we are going for. How long should I make this video? Should I just make it like an hour long of uh, of uh, just beating people with Spirit Tomb? That'd be great. Yo, if you guys want me to make a Twitch stream, leave a comment. I will gladly do this on stream. I will <laughs> I will gladly do this on stream. You have no idea. Elixirs are great. You know, Elixirs, I'm glad he's playing Elixirs. Well, I'm actually kind of sad I missed. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, if there is one thing which I request from the Pokemon Company International, make it Anna Porter... For basic energies. <laughs> Please. That would be great. I would love that. Alright. So he's uh he's going to get smart. And attached to this Dancy. So that's four. Um, The cool thing is that. Once we get the nine fightings. The strongs are just. I mean the strongs are easy. Because we run like Dino Porter and stuff. Cool. Yep. That's uh. That's all we need to do. That's all we need to do. Uh, so, looking sort of forward, I could pad for the uh, double puzzle, but not really worth it. I'd rather go for double flare grunt later in the game. Okay. Well, he's just going to attach a beast. Yeah. Retreat. Retreat. I dare you. I dare you. Yeah, attach those photo zones. <laughs> if you... Okay, it... If if you're if you're in the meme decks, like if you're just in the flat out memes, like this is the deck for you. This this right here, this is the deck for you. All right, perfect, cool. Uh, we did get enhanced hammer, which is good. We can preserve our hand, uh, for those plumerias. Okay. So he's gonna go fighting. So if we tails on, it, we better heads this. Okay, I guess not. That's fine. So we'll Plumeria Potion, and yeah, we don't need Catcher. Uh, bam. Uh, next turn, I guess I could Plumeria away Order Pad and whatever we top deck. Yeah, 
Yeah, well, he's, okay, so he only runs four strong. Yeah. Yeah, this is this is a little bad because um this is where the deck kinda kinda runs a little bit thin. Um Okay, cool. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I stand corrected. I'm fine. Sycamore. No oh it's a wild river one. We don't even want that one. Good. Sycamore that away. That's the switching one. Okay, so we can hammer. We're just going to handy work. Unless. If we get a Gladion, I'll go for that. I'd gladly go for a Gladion instead. Alright, so what's he going to Ultra Ball for? It's going to be interesting. Nothing, I guess. What else he got? Okay. Ooh, and a Porter. Cool, actually. Um, I like Anna Portering for memes. So we're gonna Anna Porter instead of Hammer. <laughs> and then we're gonna Handiwork. Double heads. Let's go, baby. Two energies. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> That's beautiful. All right, what do we got? We got six, seven, and what was that? Two strongs? No, one strong. Oh, my. This, this man's just. What was that? A oh, that was a floatstone. I thought it was like a grass Pokemon or something. Okay, so oh wait, we we might be in trouble here. Six nuts. Um, six, seven, eight, two strongs. Yeah, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. Um, we're gonna single puzzle actually. Oh, I don't like any of these cards. Mm. Man. Oh, okay, cool. That's oh, I I could you see, I just realized right before um right before I used Brooklet. Uh, I could use Brooklet to shuffle the deck. That uh that is right. I don't know, should we go for one more? We'll go for one more. I'm too greedy. I should just I should just close it at a five win streak. But uh, nah, we're going all the way on this one. Going all the way. All right, what do we got? This Bulu, I swear to. No, <laughs> it's Ninja. It might be Water Box. You never know. Why did I jinx it? Man's probably seeing Anna Porter in my starting end. You're like, what the? <laughs> Come on, let's get that 50 mulligans. Eight. Lame. Lame. All right, so we start Guzma. This is uh, what we want. Uh, please bench Remoraid. Please bench Remoraid. Please bench Remoraid. If he's playing Ninja, I'm going to cry. Yes. All right. He's playing Lapras. Great. Wait, is this Iron Pool? Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, that's not that good. That's not that good because you can still use Hug. But that's still three energy. I'll take it. Okay. So I shouldn't get too excited. That's not an auto win. Okay. And also the Volk is, um, the Volk is another option for us. So yeah, we got a lot of options. A lot of options, indeed. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go for the Catcher and then Skull Grunt. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. And if uh, if Catcher fails, I'll just Guzma. Okay. Cool. This works. Uh, yeah, that's all we need to do. Okay, so hug is three energies. So water gun is twenty, and it's only two. Um, 
I'm actually kind of nervous. He might be running like he might be running switch. Nuts, because this is a Lapras deck. Okay. Um. Hammer and then Skull Grunt. Why? Why do I flip tails on everything? Oh my word! Come on. This is such a good hand to Skull Grunt. Yeah, I'm just gonna Skull Grunt. I don't even care if he hits me for twenty. I don't even care. So he probably has like five million energies in his hand. He has to. I have to score run. I don't care if he attacks me. Perfect. Bam. It's just what we need. Uh, cool. So we're not looking good. Uh, energy switch. Oh, I forgot I played this in this deck. Okay, so he does opt to evolve. Oh man, this is not looking good. I might even just order pad for catcher. That is risky though, because I gotta, because like if I failed, I gotta burn one of my plumerias. Did he? He energy switch, so he could attack this turn. Oh, did he did he use Abyssal Hand yet? No, he didn't. He did not. How many energies are we dealing with? Not that many. One, five. Five energies. Oh my god. Here's the hug. There's the hug. Oh, awesome. Cool. Guzma works. We just need a stall. Yeah, we don't need to order pad for anything. This is more skillful than that seems. I promise. Um, if we could get the Lily up eventually, that'd be uh, be nice. Yeah, if we got a Cynthia, that'd be nice. Slowly but surely. Just need the. Milk them out of energies. Sounds so weird. No. Ho, 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 ho. I might have to Plumeria away my Plumeria. That's sad. I'm going to puzzle. Wow, this sucks. Uh, this sucks. This sucks. This sucks. This sucks. Booklet. Nothing. Just shuffle. Ah, I should have. Whatever. Um, we'll follow a turn behind. Ah, I really. Damn, what's up with all these? Oh my god, this is coming down to the wire. Literally all based on what we top that. One, two, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine waters. All what we top deck. No, you should have end. Please. Oh my god. I forgot he ran that energy switch. Ah! Okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Why did I have to play a six game? Okay, so if you're wondering how this deck loses, this is how just like is like dumb stuff like that. Um, yeah, so, uh, th that's the deck. <laughs> I, uh, hope you guys, uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you liked it, make sure to, uh, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, if you don't like it, then, uh, just leave a like anyways. Uh, <laughs> show some love. Um, but, oh, mama. All right, this is a good way to end out the episode. This is gonna be the thumbnail. <laughs> After all this, we get the we get the secret ruby string. Okay, um, so yeah, that is uh, that's the episode, um, the episode, the uh, video, and uh, yeah, play this at your league challenges, your cups, your whatever. Um, but yeah, see you guys next video.